What age did you start playing music? Guitar? Mm, like 13, 14, somewhere okay. around there. I don't remember the exact yeah. day. Why did, why did you start playing music? Um, I just... Uh, I kind of fell in love with Buddy Holly. Buddy Holly? Yeah, so I just... Why? <laughs> what, what's so special about Buddy Holly? I don't know, if you could explain why you love things, I'd, that'd be great. I'd, I'd, I don't know, just sometimes it just feels right, you know? Yeah. Something about the sound, his voice, songs, him as a person, I just felt... Yeah. You know, it, felt, it felt right. All right, okay. But, uh, because you come from a very musical family, because your father uh, was a yeah, but famous musician, but he, he, did he stimulate you or even push you to make music? <laughs> no, no, he didn't. I don't think he wanted me to play music, to tell you the truth. He didn't want you to? I don't think so. I think he... It's a tough kind of business, and it's probably... As someone who's been in it, there's a lot of stuff that happens in this business. I imagine as a father, you just wouldn't want... Yeah, your son to do that, especially since you did it. I mean, you probably want your son to do something completely different. Like, yeah, you hear that a lot from from actors and musicians. Mm -hmm. They don't want their children to do the same. Yeah, I didn't. Yeah. I never really, anyways, took anything from it. It was more like I just, just like felt. Um, I don't know. I just fell in love with it myself, and I kind of just, he kind of just kind of pushed me, in a way like. Um, Always make me work harder, I guess. He never, he never like fluffed it all up for me. He gave me the reality of the situations. So. Okay. No. Yeah. All right. And did you, from the start, uh, always wrote your own songs? Yeah, I mean that's kind of what I, what I liked about Buddy Holly's is you know, he wrote his own songs. Okay. That was interesting. Um, and for some reason, I never really put those things together. I guess I, I don't know. When you're younger, growing up, you kind of. You just, uh, you know, don't really think about what you're going to do. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, one day, it just clicks. Yeah. Okay. But because in the strokes, you, you don't write uh, material songs, but well, but you always had your own songs. Yeah. I've always, yeah. Been, always been making demos, yeah. Yeah. But you ever, never had an, an idea to do something with it until um, last year? I don't know. Yeah, I was, like, uh, pretty shy with it. And uh, I think... It, you know, Julian had found his voice and what he wanted to do before I had found mine. And uh, I enjoy his music very much, so I, it seemed like a good place to start, you know what I mean? Yeah. And then as time went on and I kind of figured out what I wanted to do and, you know, I kind of found its own way, you know? Yeah. Like all things do, they can always kind of find their own way. Yeah. And wh when was the exact time that you thought, I'm going to make this album? I never actually went in saying I'm going to make an album. I went in, it's, reco it's recorded in order of how it was recorded. Sorry, it's put in the order of how it was recorded. Yeah. Uh, I went in to do the first song, Cartoon Music, and um, just to do one song. And I went in with Greg, the producer, and uh, we did it in a day in his kitchen. And uh, it sounded really good. My friends liked it. And after a while, I was like, oh, I want to do some more. And a few weeks later, we went and did two more, and then okay. three months later we did two more, and then, you know. So Hard to Live in the City was the last thing you recorded? Yeah. It really was? Yeah. yeah. Okay. It was, yeah. yeah. What's that song about? Is it about um, Hard Life in New York? The verse? No. No. Came about, I was writing the song, and just the phrase, Hard to Live in the City, just came out in the melody, and I really liked the way it sounded. And then the verses were like three different sections of my life. Oh, when I, when I first one's when I first moved to New York. Second one is uh, just about just different experiences I had, and then hard to live in the city ended up becoming not so much hard to live in the city, but hard to live certain problems. You know what I mean? Yeah, all right. But uh, I wasn't going to change the lyric to yeah, say hard okay. to live with certain problems. <laughs> yeah, okay. It I, just kept it, I just thought it sounded better. Yeah. Yeah. 